And I had her back and I'm going to have her back. Dead or alive. I'm not going to stop. She's your little sister. I get, yes, that's my little sister. I'm sorry. I'm not going to stop at Tiger. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Yes. What, what, what is it that you want to tell the whole world to stop saying about your sister a negative or anything on Facebook, all these lies until the truth come out? What is you want, the message that you want to I want to tell them to please stop making it seem like my sister was here. Cause how she, what she had on, cause what you wear don't identify your character. That's right. You can't judge a book by its cover. Okay. So I don't care what this hotel known for, cause they got a lot of rumors that the hotel known for selling. You know what? One thing, and I'm not just saying this cause she my sister. You can ask anybody out here that know her. Kanika had two boyfriends out of her life that I know about. Tampons hurting my sister. So I stop saying that she was drunk because now it's a bunch of other videos that's at 240 that's at 230 it's a lot of more videos coming out and i have the video see she was fast she was sitting there she won she won like this or none of that so if y'all say she got lost that too somehow she in a video so she just sitting there she talking because when the ma when the manager knocked on the door whoever it was Kanika was the one of the persons that went to the door and say, they say that was a manager. You see this in a video. So she wasn't drunk and she had to come up missing around three something, not two something. It ain't adding up because we got like five more videos. They say the video so what they saying not adding up. Well, right. They, 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 they say it was at 320. Yeah. She was yeah. stumbling. They say she was stumbling. Right. I don't believe that. Well, at the front desk you're talking about, yeah. Right. In the hallway. They, they say yeah. she was walking to an employee area and they saw her on the camera stumbling, like holding on to the wall to right. walk like she was right. intoxicated. Right. Did you guys view that camera or they just, that's what no, they, 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 they said? No, they saw that after we viewed the camera. Oh, okay. They didn't show us that camera. Right. They saw that after we reviewed all, so when, once word. I left, they said they did every camera that they had in the hotel to get entry. So where? tomorrow you can get your hands on that. You can stay there and show me every. You can say show and me everything, there, right? right? I mean, so yeah, I mean, all day long if if if, 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 if they willing to show it to me, yeah. yes. Oh, no, Are you okay with me giving him your number so yes. he can reach out to you? Mm -hmm. Where is the freezer? Where's the freezer located? In the basement, right? Okay, to get to the freezer from the elevator. You have to walk straight. You gotta pass the front desk, and then you have to turn. It's a long hallway. You gotta walk through the hallway. You gotta open two double doors before you open the door. It's a camera right there before you enter the doors. And I told the police officer, I'm like, it's a camera right here. He told me it's several different ways to enter that kitchen. What about the freezer? You can enter the kitchen all kinds of ways. He's yeah. gonna have to sit there until they. He say, I say it's a camera right here, so he say it's several different ways to enter the freezer. And you, it's a long way you gotta go for her to be drunk like right. she had a man on her because she gotta. To you gotta go through yeah. a Why place, then you gotta go through a little yeah. walkway, yeah. then you gotta keep walking, oh. you gotta walk through something else, then you gotta open the little door thing, then you gotta walk some more, go through a door thing where the camera at before you get to the freezers, and then because I know this because I kept every time we went through an entrance I kept doing like this. They say no, we not there yet. They say no, we not there yet. We not there. How did she do all this? Drunk. drunk. When you drunk, you gonna be in the past. Yeah. You ain't gonna keep walking. You ain't gonna keep walking. You ain't gonna keep walking. What is it in the basement floor? It, no, it's on the front lobby. It's on the front lobby floor. Yeah, it's on the front. Once you walk past the desk, it's a little hallway. You gotta walk then straight. Then how does she know to go there? It's two big white doors. You gotta. Open the doors to get in, and it's a camera right there. I don't know about you, but me, if that were me, I'd be taking the path of least resistance. Oh, this is one. Door. Okay, well, that's too so, much work so for me. So basically, what right. they saying is that yeah. she passed the, yeah. the, the the way you exit. Yeah. To go to these doors. To get into there. It don't. It don't. It don't sound right. You have all day tomorrow to ask, right? You're gonna sit there. Oh yes. Okay. Yes. Keep in touch with us. Let me know yes. what we can do along the way. Okay. Yes. All right. I'll text you. And none of the guys that was up there with no serial killers. Either, they've been saying a lot about them too. Tell you what they the guys that was up there, the drug up yeah. and don't know your first name. Lenora. Lenora. Oh, my name's Deputy Chief Nick. Okay, and I'm here to make sure that your voices get heard. First of all, obviously, let me express our condolences. But I understand your mom's there too. Uh, how's she doing? She she holds it up. She good. Yeah. I know we've spoken to her a couple of times, and uh, I know she. Obviously, the 
where she would have been here. So like I said before, our our goal here today is to allow you guys to get your message out and let you know that you know that we're sympathetic here. We have, we have absolutely nothing but we want the truth also. And the community wants to just have to get in the beginning of it. I, I cannot, and I, I, I am being as 100% honest. You don't want me to lie to you. Hey, Chief, I am going to be. It's just the first time that they gave him any condolences. Who has the video? That's what we do. That's our job. 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 That's job. You know, he's not gonna he's he's not gonna do my job either. I'm gonna do my job and that's that's hey, what hey, we so you ain't okay. look, we can just go tomorrow. Don't don't even get into it. So yes, I would be lying as back to your question, I would be absolutely lying if I said to you that it will be ready tomorrow. Because someone, as I said tomorrow, someone told them that it would be ready tomorrow. You know who was that and why would they I do not know who said that. I obviously wasn't there or you would remember me from that. What I can tell you, it, it, if, if it's available tomorrow, the family will be contacted. And I'm not going to generally release anything without the family. See, what does and being the, available mean? Hang on one second. Let me, I mean, let me talk to you. Right, I mean, ahead. this is her sister. Go ahead. Let me so talk right, to her sister. Right, uh, so, right. as I was saying, the first thing we will do when it's available, and it, it's no, like I said to Jedediah, I can't put timelines on things because there are certain parts of an investigation that are outside of our ability to control. There's other agencies involved, like the medical examiner's office. So a lot of this is, is a puzzle pieces that we'll put together. And once we put them all together, I want to be able to come to your family and, and confidently, as I said to Jed and I earlier, I want to confidently come to your family, lay it in front of you, and tell you what happened back to life. I don't want to guess, I don't want to uh, suppose, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to make anything up. Everything I tell you is going to be based on proof. So while it's aching to not know, and it's aching when the time passes up, understand that I've got guys that are working around the clock on this case diligently, and they're putting in the time necessary to come to a truthful, honest, and provable answer. You have camera answer. guys, because the first police that came here, they told us they carry surveillance camera and they didn't see my sister. Some of, the, some of the surveillance cameras are what they can instantly review. We actually now have all of the tapes of every camera in the hotel. That makes we sense. have that in our possession. That and that's part of what we're doing by sense. piecing things together. All right. So the puzzle will come to a conclusion. And when we come to your family, it's going to be with the answers to this puzzle. It's going to tell you to the best of our abilities and as honest as we can possibly be, here's what happened. And this is why we believe that here's the A deputy chief, is there anybody else in the room that y'all need to speak to? As I as I said before, and, and I'll say this to anybody, we believe we have talked to almost everybody that was in the room. We think we got everybody. But there's a very good possibility that there's other people out there who may have stopped in, who may have been at the party, that haven't been talked that haven't talked to us yet. I mean we literally had to go looking for the people. Nobody came to us. So we did this outreach to find people. If you guys know of anybody else who was in that room, or if you reach out to anybody else who has information, 100% we want to talk to them. We want what they have. We want to know what they know, just in case it's completing another little part of the puzzle. Was they able to take off Kanika Belomis and give it to us? Were they what? Was, was, was they supposed to take off Kanika Bone? Absolutely not. Well, they did. The Cook County Medical Examiner, they'll hold, you, anything that's with her now stays with the medical examiner and then they'll release it. No, they gave her her belly ring, okay. her, her watch, and her head, the thing that was in her head. They gave us that too. And so you have those. Yes, we yeah, have. Valuables, we'd have no, I'd rather you keep them than, than somebody. Why is this evidence? Because if it's not directly related, if it doesn't have a cause and effect, we often give valuables back to the family because it's more, I'd rather have you preserving valuables than having valuables go missing. So is it, wait, Jazz, if it's a crime scene, why didn't they have the, the tape out? Like Pardon it was. Me? 
that it was a crime scene. They told us it was a crime it's, scene. Okay, and, and, and sometimes the terminology is a little different. It's definitely a death investigation scene. Okay, and sometimes that's a little bit different. Not a lot. We treat it the same. We secure the scene. Everything's photographed. Everything is forensically checked and on and out. And that's what takes so long. I mean, this stuff just... It's not like on TV. I mean, they right. just so, don't come back with answers. Right so, there. I'm sorry, but why did they miss four people that was in the hotel that they put a crowd of rowdy teenagers out? They didn't, they didn't even tell and warn them that it was a dead body found in the freezer. They said they put a rowdy teen, crowd of teenagers and out. And who, whom did they tell that to? I didn't hear you. The guests. The guests, the guests. in the hotel. Well, you know what? Nobody's, there's no, it's nobody's business. That's, That's a lot of people who keep in the hotel. That's safety. What's going on here? But if somebody comes in and they're asking me questions about you or you're asking me, I tell who needs to know. I'm not going to share if your personal information. Not if we haven't talked to the family. No, they told us already. But the guests didn't know the detectives. And then when we was outside hollering in the crowd, they wanted to the big secret because they stopped talking to us while we was outside crying because everybody was looking out the windows. I don't know if the windows open or not, but everybody was looking at us and it's like it was trying to be a secret. Because they kept telling they us, told to be us to be quiet. They told us to be quiet and they wouldn't say nothing until everybody be quiet outside this hotel. Well, I, I cannot answer for okay. what happened that night, but I will tell you as of right now, you're getting it from me that this is going to be a complete investigation and you will get an honest answer backed with evidence. So that's the most important thing. It's the most important thing. Like, like I said, the information is good and it's important to the community. It's most important to the family. And that's 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 our number one priority. It's gotta be the family, not not the community. Not that the community what they need to know isn't important, but most important is the immediate family. That's, that's, that's how I feel, and that's how I would feel. Have been connected with the lead detective on this case? He's talked to the mom. Would they say mom. the police are telling them? Your mom has spoken to our detective. They didn't tell my mama the that she was. They didn't the tell her that she could review the, the images. We also know that your mom was ill, and we, we have told her that when those are ready, we want her to come in first. She's going to be the first. Okay, she says, yeah, Were they able to tell us because the manager that was on duty was at, at the time at the hotel, he said he was going to the back to tell, to call the police. He, was the police able to tell him to tell us they wasn't able to come up here? We had to come to the station to do a missing uh, police report? I don't know about that. No, I'm I saying, don't is know. They able to do that? If they, if is they able to tell us they can't come to the hotel to make my report? I have to come to them when I tell them that my sister was last seen here. Was they able I, to tell I, me? I, 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 again, you know I don't he know what was happening to that the hotel night. He forgot to tell me to sign the paper. I know so we did come, come to the hotel. I don't know what, what time frame we talked in, but we did have officers here, and I believe then they were about the, the search of but the hotel. Only, no, the first time, he, the police officer, he only came back The paper that you're talking about is that's a release if we, and we did enter your sister into the National Leads computer system for law enforcement around the country. We entered her immediately as a missing person. The form that you signed is simply saying, acknowledging that you know we did that and that if, if, if a missing person ends up uh, showing up in California, that you're gonna you're gonna be the one to make the contact, and you know obviously if it's an adult, that you're gonna make contact. We'll tell you that we found them, and then we'll put you in contact with them. But that's all that the form that you were talking about is a release for entering and leaves. We did enter her into the national leaves. <laughs> Hotel doesn't work for me. I, I can't justify what he did or said 
I can tell you that once we became involved and we started the investigation, and since then, the hotel, their management, their upper management, have been 100% cooperative with us. They have released every bit of security tape they have. They have allowed and us to And the reason she's asking all these questions now staff. is that this, so, this is her first I mean, time since then, and, I, and I can't say what happened that night. So this I can't, is the sister that's speaking. I mean, I, I, they don't work for me. Now because exactly. she's not yet but I do know that anybody. once we write the ship, everything is going per protocol, and you will be satisfied when we're done with our findings because it will all be there. And that's all I want. That's all I want you to have. It'll be fast. Everything we give you will be back by the end. So no problem. And again, we have our people. And please, if you would, tell your mom I was talking about I was, I was asking for her. I know she's been sick and it has got to be terrible. So please extend to her my, my best wishes. Thank you so much. Thank you.